Hi, it's John. Now this year for me has been a good year for cherries. I think I bought this tree about three years ago. Got it from home base, look there. And it says the tree is going to grow um, three metres wide and four metres high. And it started off doing terrible little fruits um, like that, that didn't really sort of do. And uh, I wondered whether we were going to get any cherries. But, um, oh, look, just going back to this. Now, it's interesting that this, this actual bough that the tag is tied onto died. That, that one. But this one kept going. And it's grafted, because the graft is down, down there, look. So it's above the graft. So that one's kept going. And it's got some lovely cherries on. We've been eating them. They go from that colour and then when they're really ripe they go really deep red and they're just like cherries you buy from the shop uh, Stella it's called did I say that Stella so I'd highly recommend Stella cherries um, it is not far away well, it's about uh, two and a it's half size at the moment so it's going to grow four meters so that's just over two meters at the moment uh, Got the um, got the trouble with these uh, bogus in the tips. I don't know what they are. So it's not running, not running on full power. But um, it's fruited anyway, and I've got one or two more of these down the allotment. So been, we've been eating quite a lot of cherries, and it's nice. They're sort of like a finished thing, aren't they? A cherry. You know, you either got them or you haven't. I mean, that one's got a little bit of what I would say is canker on it. But generally speaking, there, um, you know, you either get them or you don't. Oh, that's got a bit split as well. So it probably means it's been a bit dry at times. But um, they taste just like you get from the shops. Hmm. I'm not that keen on cherries. I like fresh cherries. But I don't like the cherry flavour. don't like cherry flavoured lemonade or cherry flavoured sweets or... Oh, I don't mind tunes, cherry flavoured tunes. But I don't like that sort of mouldy taste that cherries sometimes have. But maybe I'm a convert now. So, that's it. The Stella Cherry. Highly recommended. From home base. Right, bye for now.